one thing that has always stood out to us is how Sega shipped their pre-CD and 32X games in robust plastic clamshell cases, starting with the Master System in North America. Like their cardboard box Nintendo counterparts more commonly ended up though, Sega Master System, Mega Drive, and Genesis games would sometimes find themselves orphaned. Their cases destroyed, misplaced, or worse, simply thrown out. Several options exist to replace these cases and inserts out in the wild, but for our money, nothing comes close to Stone Age gamers' bitboxes. The bitbox comes in many different makes and models to accommodate any cartridge the player may have a need to protect. In our case, when purchasing a Japanese Mega Drive, we made the decision to buy loose carts to mitigate their often very high cost. But we like snazzy cases on our shelves too, and the Bitbox was a cost-effective alternative to complete listings, especially in the case of games such as Musha Alesta. These cases are pretty heavy gauge, and they're actually heavier than that of an original Sega case. They're also a bit bigger on the X and Y while being slightly slimmer on the Z, meaning that they don't quite match up in size to the originals. However, the Sega Bitbox is also very versatile. It accommodates Sega Genesis and European Mega Drive cards easily. Japanese Mega Drive games are also a perfect fit in the horizontal cavity. Master System games also fit nicely in this space. Okay, but what about EA cards? They're narrower and taller than the normal ones. For these, the central square cavity is a perfect fit. Okay, but what about Sega 32X carts? These are a bit wider than normal Genesis games, but the vertical cavity accommodates these perfectly. A great choice for 32X boxes that have disintegrated away over the years. Okay, fine, sure, but what about Sonic & Knuckles? Well, okay, you got us, the Bitbox does not allow for storage of this ridiculous cartridge. There's no and Knuckles joke to be had here, sorry. Stone Age Gamer also offers several options for players with different needs. These cases can incorporate a document holder to store manuals and other bits like posters or registration cards. Or not, if manuals aren't as important, which can be seen here in the case provided with our Powerbase Mini FM. High quality printed inserts are also available as well, though not every cover is available at this time. Most US covers can be requested, but a lot of Japanese ones have not yet been produced. Hopefully more will be available in the future. These inserts are printed on heavy gauge matte paper using incredibly high quality printing methods. These images are stretched a bit to match the slightly different dimensions as compared to a normal case, but they still look fantastic. In the end, with all of the various reproduction cases out there, we can confidently say that the Stone Age Gamer Bitbox offers the best value players will find with regards to safe storage and excellent presentation. We are absolutely going to be working towards getting at least all of our Japanese Mega Drive games, and likely all of our Genesis shooters as well, fully cased up in Bitboxes going forward. You can get the full deets on pricing and availability for Bitboxes of your own at StoneAgeGamer.com. Link in the description below.